Hello YouTube. Uh, today what we are going to do is we are going to take a look at the tool uh, Etrocap. Now Etrocap is a free and open source network security tool for man in the middle attacks on LAN. Alright, so now today what we will be doing is we will be using Etrocap for man in the middle attack in wireless networks. Uh, it is a very good tool and this tool is also included in CEH version 11. So if you are preparing for that, this video is going to tell you about how to use it. So let's get it started. Now to um, begin with, first of all you need to have an external uh, Wi-Fi card which has been integrated with Kali Linux. Since if you are using Kali Linux in your virtual machine then you need to have a separate one because um, the one integrated in your laptop will be used up by your host machine so that is very difficult to integrate with virtual machines. So I would suggest uh, just have a cheap uh, Wi-Fi card that is uh, workable like which can be worked around which you can play with in Kali Linux as well. So I have done everything, I have done my setup. If you want like help in setting it up so just comment down below and I will make a video on that. Uh, you can see here I have like different wireless, uh, uh, okay let it load, yeah so here I have different wireless uh, um, signals uh, popping up in my Kali Linux. So first of all what we need to do is we need to connect with the network to which we want to perform man in the middle attack. So I have chosen this uh, network and I am connected to it. I have already known the password and I connected to this one. Now I, what I want is I want to perform man in the middle attack between this Wi-Fi router or this Wi-Fi access point and any of the other selected devices okay what are the data transfer that are being going through this access point and that wireless device so now that is getting started first i will check all right so here this is my wlan1 card and uh, okay this is my ip address to this one and it is up and running all right so quickly what i will be doing is First thing first, I will just uh, go ahead and click on Etrocap hyphen space hyphen G. That will give me a graphical user interface. So here you see this is the graphical user interface. All what you can do is you can go here and type Etrocap and you will get here the graphical user interface. Now it is asking me for a default password. So I'll give that. Now it is saying that it's sniffing at a startup. You can select that one. I'll be turning it off. Primary interface I'll be selecting as WLAN because this is the one I want to capture it. Now I click on OK. As soon as I click OK, here you will see that this is all ready and up. So now what I need to do is I'll click on this one. So now here it will be asking me for the like it will be showing me all the hosts that are connected to uh, that Etrocap is able to identify. Now what I will be doing is I will be just uh, running that sniffing thing. Now once I do that sniffing thing, now here you can see this is the uh, search icon so once i click on that it will be looking looping through all the hosts and it will try to identify what all hosts are connected what all hosts are uh, connected to this one so now here you see i have found this one my default gateway this is one of the devices this is one of the devices that are being connected so now i will select this uh, access point as my target one and i'll connect this device i'll choose this device as add to target two I know all these two devices, this is my network, just a disclaimer here, this is all for educational purpose, do not try this on an unauthorized or unauth uh, like uh, for on any network which you do not have a permission on. This is just for an educational purposes. Okay, so I have added these two over here, now here you can see this is being shown, like this is target 1 and this is target 2. Now what we will do is, here you can see there is an MITM menu, man in the middle menu, now here it is R poison. So before we get into our poisoning, what I will be doing is I will go ahead and quickly start my Wireshark. So Wireshark you can start from command prompt here itself or you can go here and just search for Wireshark. Here I got it. Now once we are here, select on the interface that you want to capture the traffic through. I have selected here, everything is up, it's green, it's capturing the data packets. Now what I will do is I will go here and I will select our poisoning. Now remember as soon as I go through and click on this one ARP poisoning what it will do is it will go ahead and uh, 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 flood the uh, this, uh, these two devices with the fake uh, uh, fake uh, 
uh, address resolution protocols so what will be telling them like this is the host it will be telling this like uh, this address is assigned to uh, this machine and it will be telling this IP address that this IP address that this uh, IP address is assigned to this machine so in that may it is like falsely telling both of these routers that the uh, alternate addresses are this going through these devices so all the traffic to these two devices will be going through your machine okay now I'm going to start this thing as soon as I start here you see this is this it is showing that like our poisoning victims are like one and two and here you see it is uh, throwing a lot of traffic related to our request and it is uh, telling like this is the, uh, the the host machine that I am running that the attacker is running is the actual machine which is having both the IP addresses so it is confusing both the machines so now what I am going to do is I am going to send a HTTP request from that uh, another machine which we have from this device I'm going to just send a username and password and let us see if it captures or not so I'm typing in the username as victim and password as password okay so now I'll click on login once I click on login uh, let us see if it captures or not okay it's not capturing so what we will do is let us just um, stop this man in the middle attack for a while and then try again after a few times so sometimes it does not work sometimes it works so now I just check like my device is connected to that network and it is reloading the pages so now what I will do is I will again go here and start our poisoning now as soon as I start the R poisoning with the selected option now I am going to send in the username and password of the victim over here with my device I am tapping it in right now um, victim and password will be password click on log in button so now here you can see the request is being captured in here password or I mistyped the spelling here and user is this victim so now here you can see that all the HTTP requests are being captured by this um, letter cap uh, tool and it is capturing only the two traffic coming from this device and going through this and the return also true so between all these two all the cap traffics are being captured by us and we have successfully executed our man in the middle attack so uh, if you did not understand anything or if you are facing any issues in this or if I uh, got anything wrong you can comment down below and let me know and I will be making another video uh, uh, coming up days like related to air mon, air dump and uh, uh, air replay and uh, air crack ng so yeah tune in and we will see you tomorrow or uh, in the coming days thank you